Yo, what's up guys, how you guys doing? In today's video, I'll be unboxing and as well as reviewing the Electric Strike G Fuel flavor. Inspired by Mortal Kombat 11, we got another Mortal Kombat flavor with a bunch of other goodies, like a collector's box, maybe a sticker and a shaker as well. I have the package right in front of me right here with the brand new flavor. Can't wait to try it out. It sounds very good, very interesting. The flavor is supposed to be a watermelon lemonade. Uh, that caught my attention by a lot. We have already seen raspberry lemonade, regular lemonade, well, the bubblegum lemonade, and other few flavors out there with lemonade. Now we have a watermelon lemonade. This sounds very good. Hopefully, hopefully they don't ruin the formula. Hopefully they don't ruin the taste or anything. Hopefully it tastes perfect to good at least. That's what I'm hoping for. But enough of that chit chat. Let me open this box up. Can't wait to see this. The third collector's box. This third, the third more comeback <coughs> flavor. <coughs> oh wow, that came out of nowhere. Yeah, the third more comeback flavor is not inspired by anybody or by any character. It's um just a more comeback flavor that they released it with it like an ability. I think more comeback strike something like that. I don't really pl haven't played the game in a while, so I wouldn't really know since my knowledge on that is far gone. Yeah, we got the electric electric strike collection box. That's correct. Okay, I got some other goodies here, like some samples, some paper. If you guys are interested, more paper, more paper right here. <laughs> I have a couple shakers in here as well. Shakers that we already seen, so don't need to show you guys that just leave that on the side here we have is the electric strike g fuel collector's box inspired by mortal kombat 11. let me give you guys a look at this box design there's nothing really special about it but i'll give you guys a full look <coughs> mortal kombat 11 up front and the top with g fuel energy form in the bottom with a nice baby blue color scheme black background nothing special in the side right here we have strikes all over the place a blue black ground baby blue bla black black a baby blue background and we have energy focus endurance reaction right there and we have the more comeback logo over the back as well g in the bottom black back screen black background <laughs> keep getting it confused and more comeback in there nothing special about it now onto the tub Ooh, okay Ooh, okay this shaker goes hard, holy. Damn. They expect it to have a white and gold tip. And we have the G Fuel sticker right here, Mortal Kombat 11. There you guys go, better look at it. G Fuel X, Mortal Kombat 11, baby blue and back. Back. Black, a background. Keep getting it mixed up. I'm gonna get make fun of for sure. <laughs> that is the sticker. I'll give you guys a look at this sexy ass shaker. Then we'll go to the flavor. Right there, Mortal Kombat 11 logo from Baby Blue with a nice, really nice blue, like say like a dark blue, see-through, a transparent blue with the G Fuel logo right there with electricity coming all around the edges and stuff. We have a gold and white mixed piece. Not mixed piece, that white and gold top lid. And then we have a gold mixture piece, the full look of the inside. Yeah, it's like a blue, tilt blue, I'll say. See-through, transparent. I love how the, I love how they change it up for this one. Different variety of colors, different design, you know, something new we haven't seen, like on colors as well. You know, I love how G Fuel be mixing up combinations on shakers and stuff. That's a very nice shaker. Now we're on to the top. We have Electric Strike. I don't know if this is supposed to be inspired by a character, but it looks like it is. I forgot his name, honestly, if I'm honest with you. There's a character in the side that... I know who he is, but I keep forgetting his name. I'll show you guys what I'm talking about. Right there, G Fuel Energy Formula, Electric Strike, the flavor. Inspired by Mortal Kombat 11. We go around the tub, we see a character here, one of the mains from Mortal Kombat 11. I don't know his name, so bear with me. Uh, it's been a while since I played the game. I haven't been really paying attention to anything new on the game. And now we have a nice background design, you know, with the logo right there with the character, I think, with the electric strike coming through. 
you know all the details in the background we got a big electric strike right there with the character that we just seen bringing it out in the middle like come come ha <laughs> like dragon ball <laughs> and then we have reaction energy focus on all that and the bottom design right there give you guys a loop on the bottom design uh, extraordinary design i love how this transitions with the variety of colors and there with the variety of things happening on this tub like there's a lot to cover from this tub all right let's open this one up give it a smell then i'll grab a shaker oh never mind i have my shaker here i'll just fill that up then we will give it a taste all right let me open this up haha look at that and we have a scooper out top first time in forever oh that smells good give us a smell mmm that smells very appetizing most I can smell the lemon for sure the watermelon I can get a hint of it it's like, I think it's the sweet smell that I'm getting that's the watermelon mm. smells good hopefully it tastes good let me fill the shake up okay I think that's good enough uh, let me pop this open a quick smell again and then we'll give it a taste <sighs> it smells good just for sure smell the watermelon and the lemonade Kind of reminds me of uh, one of those um, flavors from Snapple. I think it's raspberry lemonade that kind of smells like it. Or the watermelon. I, I think there's a watermelon version. It kind of smells like this. I think there's one that kind of smells like this. I'm not 100% sure on that though. You see the Snapple? Probably a different drink that I've tried before. It smells good. Let's give this a taste. Okay. Hmm? That piece of ice. Honestly, this is better than I expected. Way better than I expected. Honestly, I thought it was going to be super duper sour maybe barely any lemonade in there but this way beyond that it's super unexpected what i just tasted right now it tastes pretty good pretty damn good wow ho -ho! this flavor for sure top worthy i can tell you that already i'm surprised the lemon is not very sour or strong in here it's very light and sweet Maybe it's the combination with the watermelon that makes it sweet. Probably that's why, but for me, I don't taste no sourness really. I probably taste it like the aggressiveness a little bit in the aftertaste, but that's in the aftertaste. And it's not a big hint either. It's like a little tint, like a little small portion of it. Yeah. I can cut, uh, yeah, I can tell the, I can taste the aggressiveness of the lemon. But the watermelon really dominates that lemon texture, the lemon aggressiveness, the lemon sourness, and etc. Because the watermelon tastes sweet, juicy, no, not, not, not bitter or aggressive or strong or none of that. It just tastes pure sweetness and juiciness and balancedness on the watermelon end. And for the lemon, it's not balanced or smooth, but it's because it's aggressive, but you can taste goodness on both sides because of the combination that it releases for uh, this flavor the watermelon lemonade combination of course mm -hmm. yeah i get both equally in there both 50 50 nothing too much in the water melon end or too much on the lemonade end both balanced down the middle 50 50 but both of them has different perspectives but for both of them, different perspectives bring out an amazing texture, an amazing taste. Yeah. No odd ends. They're both equal. They're both amazing. The combination that we're getting here is really good. It's really perfect. There's nothing uh, it's called bad about it. It's just like a nice mixture. Like any company that can do really good some companies might do it more aggressive more sourness or etc but for this one for g fuel 
they t um, they did a big enough job on this, making it equal, making it balanced, bring on an amazing texture and etc. We already covered the basics and we already covered how it is. If I had to rate it, I'll probably give it a 9.5 out of 10, a for sure 9.5, almost a 10 out of 10. It just like, I felt like the um, num right number was 9.5 for me. Maybe add the lemon a little bit more, maybe I'll give it a 10 out of 10. Cause the lemon's pretty light in this flavor for sure. But great combination, great, great formula, great flavor. I enjoy this a lot. I was quite excited. I was hyped about this flavor and it, exceed my expectations give me another point of view of this flavor i like it a lot this one is probably probably better than ice shatter for me for sure yeah but yeah that's pretty much i have in today's video guys thank you guys for watching i'll catch you on the next one my friends peace out